uh, high electrical fields, radio, radars, whatever, microwaves. They're all, all insidious and toxic. This is the effect of your mobile phones when you take a phone calls. Now, on the left side is the head, the school of an adult. And you can see the penetrations of the waves in the brain. Then we have a 10 years old. And then we have a 5 years old. Of course, the more old you are, the more thick is the, your school. Here we have half millimeters, and so the wave can penetrate much more in the brain. Okay, next one. And this is a thermic photography, a thermic pictures of a cell phone user before and after 15 minutes of phone calls. Now you can see that the ear become all, almost disappear. And half of the face is red. And you may say, well, um, and then? Well, this continuing heating the cell will alter the genes inside the cells and we create brain tumors. For years, they try to hide this news. They say, no, it's impossible. But now we, we know, we prove that phone calls create brain cancer. Let me say something very important. What keeps you alive is because your body is able to maintain the pH of your blood 7.36. If the pH of your blood change, your organism will try immediately to compensate it. Now, your blood is the food you eat. Then you simply understand how much you eat the acidic food, how much you influence the acidity of your blood. So, Uh, what to do? Uh, it's okay. So that means if you eat a lot of acidic food, mien, carbohydrates, animal proteins. Then you will influence very much the pH of your blood. And what your body, what your organism will do to compensate. It will search for alkaline sources inside the body. And where are these alkaline sources inside your body?
in your bones. In your bones. All the minerals that are alkalines are stored in your bones. And then at the end your bones will become weak. And we call it osteoporosis. Now if you want, I'm not saying don't eat meat. If you want to eat meat, go back. I didn't say change. If you want to eat meat that is acidic, you have to eat something that compensates the acidic and try to keep in balance. Yes or not? What is the main source of alkaline food that you can take every day? Huh? Water. 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 Dehydration is one of the main causes of chronic disease. Because you don't drink and then you get sick. You need to drink 30 ml of water every kilograms of body weight. How much? 30 ml. Three zero. What is your weight? So you need to drink 2.7 liter every day. If you drink 2.7 liter, you will not have inflammations. And this you have to take serious because people don't drink. and spend a lot of time seated. And you can see how many DCs you may have because you sit too long. Okay. This is the first part. May I also have some water, please? Uh, <laughs> Take the chance to drink some things. Take the chance to drink some things. I took a bottle, but I don't remember where.